for over two years now. Signs have been popping up all over town claiming my dad needs a kidney. And you may have wondered, is that a real call for help? But if you call the number, you'd be connected to a family desperate to save their father's life. Amelia Strahan spoke to the man behind the signs and tells us his story. Once a college athlete, Carl Finero spent his younger years running from base to base wearing a glove. Yeah, I was always a baseball guy. Six decades later, you could still find him at the ballpark, cheering for a younger team in Kenner. I came up after the grandkids got to, you know, to be with the grandkids. The boys are nine, ten, and the girls four. We're always big, big together family. Vacations together, everything's together. But three days a week, the full-time grandfather doesn't make it to the diamond. He sits in a chair for hours getting dialysis. It's Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, I'm on the couch feeling horrible. Because of his age, he isn't eligible to join a transplant list. Most of the hospitals, if you're over 75, they won't even talk to you. But his teammates got resourceful, pinning up these signs all over town. You'd be amazed at the calls you get. Over the years, he's had a few takers, but from first call to new kidney is a process. We've had a number of people try, but it's typically a medical reason why they wouldn't succeed. And not all potential donors have good intentions. Go through all the testing. They're getting ready to schedule surgery. She calls me and wants to have lunch with me and my son. And she says, uh, I want 400 grand. But a few months ago, a promising donor saw his signs. What they're doing now is they're uh, collecting all of his medical information. So um, now we're just waiting. For now, Finero says a long road of testing is still ahead. Hopefully, uh, three months from now, I can take my signs down mm -hmm. and somebody else can put their sign up. But he's hopeful he'll be back at the ballpark full time soon a smaller player wearing his glove. In Kenner, Amelia Strahan, WWL, Louisiana. Well, one day, Finero says he hopes to raise awareness for others in need of kidney donations. Well, this